Here's how this shoe became the most controversial Nike release in a long time. This is the Nike Air Max 186, AKA the Big Bubble. It's the signature release on Nike Air Max Day on March 26 and it'll retail for 150. This is a retro of the original release of the Nike Air Max 1 that was released in 1986. But by the following year, Nike had to redesign the Big Air Bubble because it was causing soles to crack. The 1987 redesign with its three hole structure and smaller window became the Air Max 1 most people recognize today. Have you seen how upset some Air Max fans are? It's supposed to be a recreation of the original Tinker Hatfield design right down to the four chambers, larger window, some changes to the shape and curvature, plus a reworked midsole that reportedly took three years to perfect so that it won't fail. Personally, I think it's cool that Nike is bringing back the big bubble for the sake of sneaker history. If I'm being honest, it's a little shocking to see this many people upset about an Air Max, but 